We have a huge wipe day today for all my 5x servers. They will be wiped after this video is released. And shout out to the 10x US server wiping tomorrow on Saturday. That server's been growing in popularity. Maybe give it a try this week. Give me some feedback on the Discord. So today I've got something pretty huge and exciting for you. Not only do we have a quarry that's been running for God knows how long, all day at least, but I believe the clan that owns this quarry is living in a cave somewhere right over here. But I want to see if we can get some profit off this quarry. Maybe we can attempt a triple cave raid. Where the turret's at, there's one auto turret. What's up with that? There's an AK on the floor over there. There must have been some action in here. Literally only one turret, I think, that we have to take. And we can easily just use 5.56 five, ammo on this one. Is that for real? All we're gonna have to take out. Okay, one there as well. I imagine these guys have some sort of storage in here, some boxes. Let's go ahead and use two rockets on this. See if we can't get in there for cheap. Okay, well there was two doors right there. I had to use four rockets. Looks like there's a garage door though left open. Some boxes in here. This thing is mostly sealed off though. 1500 so if we're gonna need to see more than that 1400 GP though Let's see if we can get any hints here. No, they didn't name their bags electric hub 22 explosives all right, so that could have been profit right there on its own Let's see what this quarry holds I think we're gonna have to take out one of these auto turrets though Oh baby, yeah, we definitely are more turrets than I thought. Okay, apparently there was a freaking turret up there on the second floor of this thing, only facing the outside. I was able to get back in here with 2C4. I thought we might have to take one out, but I think we can loot my body. We're totally looking solid now. One turret there, I think. Can loop around and grab this quarry now. Here we go, boys. Moment of truth. 46k sulfur? Let's go. Was that worth it? Heck yeah. Wonder how much low grade they got in here. Just for curiosity's sake, see how rich these guys actually are. 3,000 low grade sitting in there. All right, boys, that's some huge progress. Let's see what we can do with that cave. All right, guys, this is a trip cave, meaning it's got two entrances and then a third cave over there on the far side where the loot is most likely kept. We're gonna have to do this thing by sending incense rockets behind me to block off these counter raiders. We had some action up there right after I escaped with the sulfur from that quarry, got kind of lucky. We'll start with some incense. And you guys know this raid's gonna take upwards of 100 C4 if they built this thing all armored and perfect. Here we go.
Ooh, looks like we might score here on this half wall. What the heck? Kind of sneaky there with the shotgun trap. I'm gonna fall for that though. This should be on to the next and last cave. Ooh, okay, shotgun trap facing sideways. We'll start insetting it off from here on out. Alright boys, on to the final cave. Let's hope we brought enough for this one. Ooh, we can see a fire kind of close by. We're gonna have to start using rockets now though. Oh my gosh, we're so close. I can practically smell the loot from here. Okay, this is getting really scary, boys. That was our last freaking regular rocket. We've got three C4 and about 241 explosive ammo. We're so close. Let's go. Looks like we freaking made it, boys. There's coffin sleepers. 440 gunpowder. We need to see so much more than that. Who the heck is this, anyway? E girls? The heck? Um, armor? Oh my gosh. I imagine that fire's been running for like hours. What the heck? This thing's cleared out. Dude, there better be freaking loot in here. Okay, here's TC. Looks like this is the main loot. Let's get this thing sealed off. Mmm, that might overlap TC with the other caves. Let's see what we got here. Alright, that's not terrible. Pretty bad though. Worst case scenario, we'll start incending this off. We got one wall separating us from the counters and we've got one loot room to look through. Supply signal. Let's throw that as a celebration of raiding this base. Incense. Okay, well they definitely have weapons. Oh my gosh. Coffins upon coffins. Pretty organized as well. Another M2, two auto turrets. Okay, here's the C4 box. Hopefully they have more than six C4 though. Oh my God, that's what I'm talking about boys. Two stacks of GP, 86 tech trash. Holy crap, dude. Explosive ammo, more tech trash, obviously tons, tons of components, more sulfur. Like we even need any more to profit. We are already in the profit. Uh, we still have TC. Two more supply signals. Yeah, TC's got HQM, but no sulfur in it. All right, if we do the math here real quickly, I want to say that's borderline 170 C4 we can craft. Obviously, if we got more tech trash, about double that amount of tech trash, we could do it. But that's almost double the profit, guys. On a triple cave, that is super unlikely. And this campfire had nearly 10,000 HQM in it. Mats are gonna take a second. I cannot take all these weapons. Gonna need some help with that, boys. But yeah, shout out E-Girls Clan. What a wipe they must have had.